Interdiction evaded. There you go. Good job. Suck it, Trebek. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well played, sir. Well played. Suck it, Trebek. Hey guys, the Hacker Nerd here. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe for more awesome content. Let's get started with the video. Hey guys, how's it going? The Hacker Nerd here. Welcome back to Elite Dangerous. I'm joined in multiplayer by my buddy Vibor. Hey buddy, how's it going? Hey, hey. Hey. So uh, we're uh, we're trying to get missions going, try, trying to get the monies as you, you tend to do in this game. Uh, and Vibor just turned in a couple of missions, I believe, right? Yep. So that means you're looking at maybe having enough income to, uh, or a balance, a uh, high enough balance to get you situated with a new ship. Is that something you might be interested in doing? Sure. Always love shiny things. All right. So here's, here's a decision you need to make. You can either go combat focused or you can go, uh, hauling focused. I like money. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, you can get money through combat or hauling. <laughs> so you tell me what you want to do, bud. Uh, I, I, I've tried the combat in this game, and I am absolutely horrible at it. Okay. So we'll get you so. situated with a hauler then, probably. Um, so let me let me see what we got here. So there's the Sidewinder, there's the Eagle, there's the hauler, which will give you... Two C fuel tank of cap for two... two e Two two E cargo racks. Okay, what else is there? There's also the adder, which would give. How much did you say you have? 184k. Okay. We could probably get you into an adder. Yeah, let's do that. Cool. All right. So um. So you are uh, okay. So you are currently where? Um, Ferguson Gateway. All right, come to Brand Hub if you're done at Ferguson. Okay. Cobra multi roll. Cobra doesn't have a whole bunch of uh, storage though, and plus it's 349. So like we're not there yet. <laughs> the adder is in uh in our in our budget, but for me. You know, now that I'm talking about this, I am at 293. Commander Saber says, Eagle, made of tinfoil, dies the moment you look at it. Pretty much, <laughs> yeah. You gotta, well, the thing is, the Eagle is very nimble. So, right. So if you, if you A-rate an, uh, an Eagle, you can get pretty good results out of it. Uh, as long as you don't get hit. <laughs> Not even once. Not even once. Well, I mean, as long as it's with just like a, a a, a BB gun or something. I ain't waiting for Q. Let me out of this place. Wipers where I am. Three. Oh, that was there. bad. Oh, what'd you do? I bounced off the uh, the, uh, <laughs> the dock bay. Oh, no. It's okay. Nobody seems to be mad at me. <laughs> I don't have anything going on over here. All right. So just let me know whenever you're branded. Uh, we'll get you situated. All right, I'm yeah. in station. Where were you? Uh, brand. Brand. Brand hub. Yeah. Okay. So hard points. Where am I sitting with with hard points? Yeah. Multi cannon. It's a two F and a one G. What? How do I get mismatched stuff? Okay. Is a two F multi cannon. Well, at full throttle, it'll take me a little over a year. Well, I got to jump. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gotta jump, man. <laughs> that was big. Oh, jeez. Okay. Medic. I just want a multi cannon. It'd be the worst game ever. Hmm. That's not Real bad. time travel, you know. No, oh, yeah, no, yeah. No jumping. <laughs> <laughs> and buy the game and, and like just let it No sit. Man's Sky without the jumping. You just you just buy a computer and leave it over in the corner, and then on your <laughs> deathbed, you're like, yes, I made it! <laughs> to the nearest star. Uh, okay, what do we got? So we got a one. These are all. Or your 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 grandkids are, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Here, little Johnny, I started this save for you. We're three quarters of the way there. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, so. God, that would suck. Mm-hmm. The beam laser. So I just had a one E, and that'll put me at. Ooh, I might need to upgrade my power. 
put me right under it. So eight ninety eight point nine seven versus nine. Let's do it. There you go. Two beams. Small and a medium. Multi cannon. Let's see what we got. So utility core internals. Power plant wouldn't be bad. 3D. So I do. I would need a 3C. Get any sort of boost out of that. 3B would be nice. Give me 11. I support power distributor. Yeah. 3C is not bad, actually. I'll leave that alone. And we're pulling a haggard. <laughs> What'd you do? I'm flying by. <laughs> Loop of shame. Yep. Oh, reinforcements. Yeah. It's gonna put weight on me though. Instead of leaving the throttle in the blue like I should have, I mm -hmm. just kept it full wide open. <laughs> I'm gonna drop my jump range, but I'll have better integrity. Full integrity. Do that. So I have empty compartments out the wazoo that I didn't realize I had. So cargo racks, collection limpets, interdictors. Oh, so uh, do you know what interdiction is in the game? Have you ever in been game, interdicted? No. Okay. So no. if you're carrying cargo and there's pirates mm -hmm. out there, um, they will, if, if you're in the middle of uh, like super cruise, they won't get mm -hmm. you if you're in FSD jump, but if you're in super cruise, uh, all of a sudden your screen will, will flash and then you'll have this weird effect with a reticle. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you keep your nose pointed at the reticle the whole entire time, you can escape it. Um, the other option is to uh, throttle down and submit. Um, and a tactic there is to throttle down, submit, and then as soon as you uh, jump out of, or you drop from Super Cruise, immediately mm -hmm. uh, spool up your, your Super Cruise again. Because then they sometimes don't have time to get to you at that point. Uh, the other option is to submit, see if you can take him on, and then take him on. <laughs> but uh, interdictions are an interesting th thing that happens in the games. Right, Locking denied. Uh oh. And a oh, small fuel scoop. I just wasn't in range. Gotcha. Yeah, you gotta be within 7.5 kilometers, I think. Yeah, I was like 7.63 or something. Mm. I was like, eh. Mm hmm. Material port suite. A kill warrant scanner, point defense. Anything else I want to change up? Power plant. I probably could go ahead and do that. So a three, three B. Nice. Would be nice. It's gonna put me close, right? Six. Put me real close. There we go. Nice. All right, I have uh, upgraded my stuff. <laughs> now my colors are all weird because I've adjusted my colors in game. So disregard. I think that's something I'd have to buy. Yep. Okay. Shopping mode off. Excel. Um. What about Starport? Oh. That's fine. Okay, so how you doing, bud? Are you have you arrived? Yeah, just docked. Yep. Shipyard. Okay. Uh, so we want you said to add her. Mm, okay, one second. Starport services. Have over on the right hand side there's shipyard. Mm -hmm. And then if you click right until you hit adder. Adder is eighty seven thousand. Um all right. it is said that if you go in and sell all of your modules you've purchased for your ships, it gives you more um, back in the long run. Mm -hmm. uh, but personally, I just like to sell everything all at once so I don't have to go back, so I don't have to spend the time going and selling everything one by one. And since you've only um, purchased your FSD upgrade, uh, you can mm -hmm. go ahead and just sell that all in one go. Uh, but yeah, go ahead and click uh, purchase options and you have the option to store current ship or exchange current ship. Um, all right. I mean, unless you want to hold on to that Sidewinder, uh, I would suggest you go ahead and exchanging it. 
Uh, cost of new ship 87, part exchange on current ships 48. Hey, this new ship only cost me 39. There you go. If I trade in the Sidewinder. Yeah. I mean, if you wanted to go one step up, I don't know. I don't think you'd have enough for it, but the Viper Mark III is what I'm in. I actually, I have 184. Oh, and it's 142. Ooh. Mm hmm. Well, um, there's not a whole lot. There's uh, 12 slots of storage the way I've got mine kitted out. Um, mm -hmm. It's it's more of a combat ship. So, I mean, if you wanted to get the Viper, you wouldn't be able to upgrade things as much as if you would in the um, in the Adder. So uh, that that's that's your call. Yeah, let's go with the Adder. Okay. Hey, look at that new ship. Ta-da! <laughs> And then once you get situated there, you want to go into outfitting. Oh, this dash looks all funny. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a miniature. It's a delivery truck. It's a space del delivery truck. Amazon boxes in space. <laughs> Correct. Let's see. You said outfitting. Mm hmm. Damn, that's an ugly ass ship. Yeah, it's not the prettiest. 1F pulse laser. Okay, so you're looking at your hard points? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't have much in the way of, of um, firepower. So we're going to try to avoid um, getting in fights right now, so don't worry about your hard points just yet. Um, okay. You want to check your core internal and your optional internal. You'll probably want as much storage space in your optional internal, uh, optional internal as possible. So um, if you hop into optional... Mm. Okay, so you see on the left hand side there's like numbers and then dots. Mm -hmm. If you have empty dots, that means you have a lesser, um, you you have room to expand basically. So if you gotcha. if you have three dots and you only have two dots, you can actually upgrade to a three. I don't know necessarily what that refers to, but you, you can upgrade there. You have space to, to upgrade. Um, the uh, there's classes. There's um, E class is the worst. D is light, but it's half decent. C is a good middle range. B is not too bad. And then A, of course, is the best of everything. Um, I don't necessarily know what the pros and cons of each class are, but obviously A rating everything is the best. Um, I hear that if you want to maximize your jump range, you want to focus on getting D class everything. Um, mm -hmm. But for what you want to do, uh, since we're going to be doing a lot of hauling, all your empty slots fill up as much as you can with uh, storage space. Okay, so like cargo rack 3E and gives me an 8 plus to my cargo capacity. Cool. Um, you'll want to keep a shield generator. Um, don't get rid of right, that. Well, this was a, one of those two spots that was uh, empty. You know, it, it, it was uh, a three with two dots and I had three dots available. Gotcha. Or, you know, one that was empty. Gotcha. So you can sell so that and upgrade I'm to just, a bigger one. Just, yeah, I'm just upgrading right now. Okay. a couple of empty compartments here. Flight assists. Those are new. Yeah, I've got two empty compartments too. All right, it's additional super cruise guidance to predetermine destination. I would actually like to try this. I don't worry about the, the docking or the advanced computer, but the super cruise assist would help me keep from Shield doing loop machines. I think I'm going to do that. Module type limit exceeded. I guess because that's a core. Hey, I can buy a fuel scoop. Yeah, that's good. So uh, anytime you're jumping, uh, if you just hang out near the star, but not like super close to it, it you mm -hmm. can actually collect fuel. And there's certain stars you cannot pull fuel from. Um, but you just, as long as you be mindful of where you're jumping and what, what stars you're going to, um, it's not generally a problem. But uh, also when you're plotting routes, it'll tell you the last jump you'll be able to make at a fuel fuel star so that really helps yeah, I guess we can just go with like another cargo rack might as well sure. we can get a larger fuel scoop and be able to um what what size 
fuel scoop did you do? Is it a one or a two? Huh? It was the uh, the only one I have is a one available. It's to a one. Me. Okay. All right. So if I stick with the one, we'll be able to scoop about the same rate. So that way, either one of us are sitting there waiting. So a two B frame shift drive is better than a three C. Um, the larger the number, the the more more effective it is. The bigger it is. Gotcha. So you can have a bigger thing that'll get you further than a higher rated lower uh, lesser thing. If that makes sense. Okay, so I have a three E installed for a uh, frame shift drive. Ten point, yeah, which gives me a ten point two eight light year. Ten point two eight. I am. Is that your min buy, or your max? That's the max. Okay, I'm at twelve point two seven. I can buy a three C that'll put me up to fourteen point nine. Okay, just keep uh, track of your balance versus your insurance cost. Insurance cost at this point is only five, and I've got one hundred thirty one. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and uh, upgrade cool. that. I think then probably. Shift. And I just realized I'm sitting here looking at it. I'm at thirty-eight thousand. My insurance cost is forty-three. So yeah, I'm gonna stop buying things. <laughs> Whoops. I'm gonna have to do a couple of missions and not get exploded. Okay. So mm -hmm. Would be a good thing. Yeah. Cannons. And then those are fine. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. All right. I'm situated and ready whenever you are, buddy. I'm going to put a fuel scoop on this thing. Yeah, not a bad call. Yeah, mission Only board. 309 credit. <laughs> okay. I'm going to kill people. Not planning on doing that just yet. Deliver two units of animal meat in the name of democracy. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay then. Mine stuff. Liberate one bootleg liquor. Yeah. <laughs> job available. Of course, there's a courier job. There's always a courier job. Assassinate. But the only one that I saw that looked kind of interesting for me. What is that deliver two units of animal meat thing? I think I'm going to go ahead and pick that one up. Okay, I think I got what I got. Uh, yeah, well, that's not worse comes to worse, I die. If I die, I die. Right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and collect items well, this time. Be, What's up? We're not going to be assassinating any known pirates. <laughs> no. Okay. So, Career job for 107,000 credits. Okay, I just uh, picked one up. Just heads okay. up. Uh, mine goes to... Um, Vero, Vero Andy? <laughs> okay. So if you can find something... One leg liquor. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Let's see. Anything for Vero Andy. And fuck that. It is. Yeah, it's going to give me two jumps, one to Arcadian. Okay, so the only one I have for Vero Andy is the Liberate One Bootleg Liquor. Okay, what are what is the details on that? I need to find the missing bootleg liquor. Cargo is unique to the mission. Okay. Required intelligence that it says it'll be in the Vero Andy system. Take item to Brand Hub. Receive your reward. Okay, I do remember seeing that. So let's maybe let me let me take a look at that. Mission too. may require the use of a surface recon vehicle. Oh, SRV. Um, yeah, we don't have SRVs. Well, maybe maybe you do. Uh, go back to outfitting. And I think it's an in optional internal. Planetary approach suite. Okay, that allows you to land, but do you have anything about an SRV or anything? No. No, okay, so we can't do that. All right, well, um, you can either follow me or do your own thing for a little bit. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and launch. All right. Yeah, I think I'm going to grab that 100,000 one and uh, 
All right. Uh, do me a favor. Uh, hit four and look at your inventory slots and tell me how many you have now. Sixteen. Sixteen. Okay. You have four more than I do. Oh wait, no, I added two more. So. Oh, oh. Yeah, that's that's how we do it. That's exactly how we do it. Oh dang! I just ran into something. Yeah, I'm up to fourteen now. Okay. John says that's a hard mission. Which? Yeah. Which mission are you talking about, John? Probably the bootleg liquor thing. Bootleg. Sidewinder can't have an SRV. Well, I mean, he's not in a Sidewinder anymore there, bud. We literally just got him into an adder. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> Space you throttle engage. What is that? I've not seen that before. Courier job to Vero Andy. I guess the missions must have. Uh... Yeah, they update every so often. Alright, well, I'll take that one. Hey, where am I going? Over here. That wasn't really a fuel scoop there. Vero Andy. Whose mission would mean you'd have to pick up it up with a cargo scoop. Yeah, and it also says something about you may need an SRV, and we don't have SRVs, so I wouldn't want to pick it up and not be able to do it because we don't have SRVs. I'm coming to Vero Andy. Nice. By choice, or did I just pull yeah, you along I found with a me? Mission. No, I found a mission to drop courier stuff off. Sweet. Gonna fuel scoop for a little bit. Oh, this little little fuel scoop ain't doing much for me. <laughs> Better than nothing. Yeah, I'm good. I want to fly around for a minute or two. All right, where am I headed? Um, Instant station. Did I not lock on? There we go. Oh, I'm right here too. Too fast. I thought this computer thing was supposed to help me out. <laughs> 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 or maybe it was and I, I was I was changing my throttles and everything and it was uh, I overrode it or something. I don't know. I figured out. No, I just jump. Oh, look at that. I'm pulling in fuel. Yep. Uh, fuel scooping. Yeah, if you uh, if you find a balance between keeping your heat low and getting a lot of fuel, that's you can just loop around the star until you're full up. It's pretty awesome. And then when you get like the bigger, like class three, class four, class three, whatever fuel scoops, you can literally fuel from empty in just a matter of 10, 15, 20 seconds. Maybe not quite that quick, but it's it is fast. Said. So another thing, um, if Apparently you're just flying around, or, or, hmm? where I needed to go is like right here. <laughs> mm, gotcha. So I'm doing the loop of shame because I didn't realize it was literally right here. 
Uh, Pedro, hey, thank you for subscribing. Welcome, welcome, buddy. So another uh, bit of information. When you're flying around in standard, like not super cruise, right. if you keep your throttle in the blue, mm -hmm. that that will give you the most responsiveness out of your out of your ship. Like if you need to move around and, and, and you know do a lot of fine motor control or if you're in a, a fight or something and you need to be as nimble as possible, keeping it in the right. blue will give you the most responsiveness. Out of your thrusters and steering and everything. Oops. Unless, of course, the station that you're going for is literally right here. <laughs> Are you going to Henson too? Uh, Baker Orbital. Oh, okay. It's like you jump in, the star's right there, and then you make a left, and Baker Orbital is right in front of you. <laughs> hey, don't complain nah, about I that. I didn't man. realize that. Yeah, don't, don't complain about that, because there could be other ones out there where you're sitting there for minutes waiting for it, so... The, the ones that are that close time. are great. Jeez, you know. Hmm? Yeah, 11 minutes of real time, and that's at Super Cruise. <laughs> yep. I hate uh -huh. this game. <laughs> <laughs> I made some monies. I'm back above my rebuy cost now, thankfully. Okay, is there anything fun here? Courier job, courier job. More time, but black box salvage. I'm hoping maybe I can find one where you and I can work together to deliver some stuff. Deliver six units of clothing. Four units of clothing. Survival equipment. Two units of clothing. And Vero Andy. I'm, I'm literally already in Vero Andy. Where's that going? To Gromov Orbital. I remember the first time I played this game, you know, I was doing the keyboard and mouse. I got so frustrated that I just started shooting everything I could see. <laughs> yeah. Needless to say, it did not end up well for me. No, no. All right. Well, there's one here uh, to deliver two units of clothing for 37,000 to like the next station over in the system. I'm going to go ahead and pick that up. Somebody you know, they really like their suit. Why not? Their suit? Yeah, well, two units of closing for 37000 Oh, yeah. Oh, I see what it's you're saying, expensive, yeah. It's expensive, you know? Absolutely. Okay. Destiny, wartime, wartime, massacre, massacre. Deliver two units of basic medicine for 47000 Deliver two units of survival equipment. 55 For war supplies, three units of battle weapons. In Vero Andy again. Where's this going? I'm going to be like hanging out in this system for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> sure. I mean, I don't mind making money just jumping back and forth in the same system. Why not? Okay, so I've got a strategic data transfer for twenty-seven thousand credits. And then I can pick up a courier job for 22,000 credits. And they're both going to the same system. Hmm. What system is that? Uh, e H E C A T L. E H E C A T L? Mm hmm. Oh, a wartime black box salvage mission. Uh, strategic data transfer. Okay. I can pick that one up as well. Uh, H. Anything going to that? Nope. And. Okay, cool. Um, well, if you want to go ahead and head to that E H E whatever, I have mm -hmm. two. Um, stations I need to hit in the system we're in currently, and then I'll meet you over there. Okay. Alrighty. Sections. I wish I had two more storage units. <laughs> yeah, two right. more storage. I'll deliver 18 units of cobalt, and it's 241,000 credits. Oh, man. Can't win them all. Yep. Wait. Wait. 
them off. Do that. Let's go ahead and launch. There's a new Super Cruise module you can buy and it will speed for you. Yeah, John, I actually... Have you been watching the stream? I, I literally bought it. <laughs> Last station. <laughs> He's watching it. It's just like five seconds related. No, five, five minutes delayed. Yeah, it's fine. I need to do something to activate it. Oh, it's for V? Oh, okay. Well, if you want to tell V, go over, hop on his stream and tell him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, let's see your modules. I'm doing quite well. Rear scanner. Preparing to jump. Boom reported. What does that mean? Uh, I think it means that the system is doing well, like the economy is in a boom. Gotcha. Okay, I'm actually not going to touch my Ooh. throttle and see if the thing will take over and, and throttle me down as it's supposed to. Now, do I have to, when I'm fuel scooping, do I have to keep moving or can I just sit here and sit still? No, you have to move. Oh. Well, Think of it fun. like picking up buckets of water. Okay, gotcha. this thing didn't work at all. <laughs> Immediately oh, too went. Too close, too close, too close. Oh, dang. Apparently, I have a full misunderstanding of what this thing is supposed to do and capable of. I have to look that up. Okay, there we go. That's better. You don't, you don't have to move to scoop fuel, really? I thought you did. Never mind. It's easier to uh, balance your your heat and your collection speed, though, if you're moving. You can zero throttle. Okay, I did not know that. Uh, my ship looks like a roasted to a roasted marshmallow right now. Oh, uh, uh, was it beeping at you? Yeah, I got a little close. Oh. It's good habit to, uh, as soon as you hit a system uh, and you see the star in front of you, you just immediately just turn away from it. Yeah, I was trying to scoop fuel, so. Ah, I see, I see. You got too close. Got it. Aligned with that. Okay, four. There. Once again, I've gotten too close to the sun. <laughs> 232. Oh, man. I'm, I think I'm going to explode. Oh, no. There it is. A line with escape vector. I don't see. Oh. It's meant to set the right speed in Super Cruise. Super Cruise is always moving. Yeah. Right. Well, I mean, like in Super Cruise, when I'm heading towards a target, it's supposed to like slow me down as I approach. Again, maybe I'm misunderstanding the purpose of that thing. I thought it was supposed to keep my speed at a reasonable pace, like, so I don't necessarily have to do the loop machine. Over two units of clothing. Very cool. Oh, okay. Um, so apparently you can partial complete. Partial complete what? Oh, deliver items, right. Okay. Here we go. So if you don't have enough space, you can and pick I up. And exploded. Oh. Oh. That's no good. Thankfully you had that rebuy. Mm-hmm. Okay. And going to that e cost me all of five thousand. <laughs> that up. The little thing of Bob. 
Chambo. Some of these names are funny. We have a war supplies of 14 units of personal weapons. But the thing is, that gives 183,000. It's in the same system. Okay. Oh. I mean, I mean, yeah. Very full. Okay, I'll have to come back. Cargo hold at maximum capacity. Okay. E. Oh, that's fun. Uh, I'm just like, I forgot I had the throttle still full forwards. Mm -hmm. So as soon as it unlatched me from the docking platform, I just went straight forward. <laughs> straight up. Yep. 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 No, this not is... up. Straight forwards. Yep. 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 Up would have been fine. <laughs> I ran into the control panel tower thing. Oh, man. flashbacks the first time I played this game. Yeah, well, I mean, it just it just takes a while, man. There's a lot of little things that you'll eventually get used to. Don't take it too hard. Just don't fly without rebuy, bud. That's the big thing. Well, I mean, really, at this point, what's it going to do? Put you back in a sidewinder. Sidewinder. Yeah. <laughs> it's like this game. You have to chip away at chip away at success, and you can very quickly lose the hours that you've managed to to get towards success. You know. Make sure you can take that cargo to the station. Some don't like weapons. Get scan is fine. Oh, okay. It'll set the speed for you unless you set up speed up. Okay, so if I don't, I haven't touched my throttle once I jumped into Super Cruise. So you're saying that if I don't touch my throttle once I get towards uh, the gateway here, it'll auto de-throttle? Like it'll slow me down automatically? So you can turn nasty real quick? Yes, absolutely. So, did it at least put you in the same system you were in? Yep. Not at the station I needed to go to, of course, but in the same system. Hmm. So, it will control my speed. Okay. I'm not touching my throttle. Okay, we're coming in fast. Slow down. Nope. Blew right past it again. This thing's worthless. <laughs> again, maybe I'm misunderstanding the point of it. Okay, it is taking control of my speed. It's just not as effective as I'd like. Oh, is a hotkey for the Super Cruise thing? Okay. I'll have to check that out before next stream. Where's the planet? Now, when I jump out of uh, frame drive, does mm -hmm. it matter how, what the distance to my target is? 
um, like closer to better. When you're when you're coming out of super uh, frame drive from one system to another, it always uh, super cruise. Sorry, super cruise. So yeah, if uh, if you're if you're trying to go to a place via super cruise, um, mm-hmm. if you look on your bottom left hand side, it'll show you the indicators of your speed and your distance. You have right. to make sure you're in the correct both speed and distance before you drop out, or else you won't drop out close to it. Gotcha. so glad for this auto dock <laughs> I had such a hard time the first time I tried playing this doing that stupid dock mm. I mean yeah. it didn't help I was on keyboard and mouse but you know. oh seriously man seriously no I uh I land and launch all on my own and you're hardcore I can't help that welcome to our starboard commission board this up or drop this off further. Okay, battle weapons. There we go. Complete. 39,000. Almost 40,000. Cool. Wow. I got mm-hmm. 40,000 credit for this nice. courier job that was only supposed to be 20 some. Okay. I'll go. Did you do the uh, expedited thing? I guess. Okay. Two units of basic medicines. That's not too bad. Do we? You're still in, uh, you're headed to the Hectol or whatever? Yep. You're in there. We would like, we would like yep. The oh, okay. Uh, well, I need to hurry then. I'm not going to pick up this mission though. Unless you don't mind just hanging out for a minute. No, I got one more to drop off, so you're good. Okay. Hectol, wartime black box. Do that. Yeah, let's just finish up what I'm doing here. Okay, let's see what we got. Protections. So the two e hectol things there. Um, this is a message to all commanders. Please reduce your speed when maneuvering your. So Gromov. Let's go back to Gromov. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> John says one thing he doesn't do anymore is speed when flying into a station. Well, you or me? No, John in chat. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, okay. So yeah, he I tried do the that. speeding flying out of the station. It did not end up very <laughs> well for me. Most of the time I can do pretty good, but sometimes I still smack my face. Well, the auto one dock had me queued, and I was like, I ain't waiting for this. Yep. So I just floored it and yeah. <laughs> ended up badly. <laughs> I didn't explode, but I definitely bounced off a few things. <laughs> a little bit of ship ping pong. Ship, uh, what is it? Scratch isn't dense, so I only add character. Yeah, right. Uh, I'm getting scanned. I got battle weapons on me. Hopefully that's not bad. Well, it was nice knowing you, Hager. Hager, do you still have that flying bit in Elite? Do what now? Clarify your statement, sir. Back to Gromov to pick up stuff, and then I gotta drop. Interdiction detected. Okay, just keep your nose pointed at the reticle. Yep, I'm working on it. I'm trying. And if he pulls you out, um, immediately try to engage your super cruise as soon as you can. Uh, the FSD cools down. By the way, you fly into the station at full speed. Oh yeah, yeah. I just try to get in and out, man. We don't waste any time. Evaded. Uh, evaded. Sorry. Evaded. Nice. Good job. <laughs> evicted. <laughs> <laughs> I 
And now the thing if is... If I'd had a keyboard and mouse, I'd have been dead. <laughs> yes. Yes. Good job uh, evading your first interdiction, bud. Thank you. And we blow right by the port. <laughs> seconds. That's too long. Let's go faster. Indeed. And now we're like nine hours out. <laughs> yeah, if you're going full speed and you're heading towards a station, if you hit that, it, like I was telling you, if you set that key bind for 75% throttle. Right. Uh, if you do that yeah, about... Yeah, I was going way seven, too fast for that. Yeah. <laughs> if, you, if you hit it about seven, when it says there's about six, seven seconds out, if you want to be on the safe side, do seven. If you're trying to hurry, do six. You can still miss it at like a lower six, but it usually does pretty good. Yeah, usually I'm all right as long as I pay attention to what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. easy okay, good. I'm glad you told me about that interdiction thing before it actually happened to me <laughs> if that yeah. had happened to me and you hadn't told me I would have been freaked the heck out what's going on what's going on good to see you playing this again uh yeah I mean, it's fun it's a fun game Andy I do enjoy it it's just um before it's, it's me in the vastness of space it's just kind of you know, I'm lonely out there, man. It's kind of nice. In space, uh, no one can hear you sing show tunes. Oh, Jesus. What did I, what did I say <laughs> the other night? Or here you get launched out of an airlock. <laughs> all right. So do, okay. I have 14. Is that all 14 that was needed? Sweet. That's exactly what was needed. Okay. So where is this going? I think this is in the same system. Henson, okay. Okay, one more drop off in the system and I'll be on my way over there. Okay. And uh, looking at my time now, if you want to take care of something else, um, instead of just hanging out there and waiting on me, um, you could probably do that. We're probably going to be wrapping up this episode in a little bit. See what we got. All right. There's just something satisfying about this game, being able to pilot your own ship and try not to crash into things and eventually upgrading and building skill as a pilot. Pretty fun. I've managed to pick up four cour courier style missions to the same system. Nice. You eventually want to make use of that, uh, that cargo space you got there, bud. <laughs> I mean, I, the way I see courier missions is like they hand you an envelope and you put it in your pocket Pretty and much. walk off. All right, so just got to hop over to Henson Station and we should be done with this system. Oh, 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 oh. I 
don't know if I ever scanned this system. If you get a discovery scanner, every system mm -hmm. you go to, you can scan it. It'll, it'll give you um, information about the uh, planets in the system, and you can eventually sell that exploration data. mission I have to go back to the L11933 system and, mm -hmm. and go to the other system. Okay. I mean, it's like a multi-step yep. mission? Oh, okay. I think they added those. Yeah, yeah, they added those. Uh, so that's the thing that happens. I'm not going to mess around with trying to scoop fuel off the sun. <laughs> yeah. At least not until I'm a little more confident. Yeah, yeah, you'll get there, man. Okay, ooh, I have messages. A reputation change. Reputation change. Promotion to dealer. Ooh. Yeah, I got a promotion to peddler. <laughs> nice. Not sure I, mm, how I feel about that title. <laughs> You'll get there. you work your way up to Elite eventually. Okay, so I have two things I need to do to drop off in that EHEC or whatever system. Which is just like... Like... There. Yeah. Hello? Okay, apparently that's another thing that's working right now. Bigger profits now? Yeah, I literally doubled my, my balance. No, I more than doubled. I was at 163, and I think I'm now at 183. No, I picked up 183 from the mission. I had 160-something. Not a bad pull. How many jumps do I have here? jumps okay not bad b-boy is in super cruise Trying not to smack into things. Oh, uh, with promotion you can... Oh, okay, so any time you get promotions, you can get better paying missions. That makes sense. Oh, yeah. I guess because they trust you more. Yeah. It also means you can screw up bigger, too. <laughs> Very true. Interdiction again. Here we go. Oh, no. Ooh. I'm getting good at this. There you go. There he is. Interdiction evaded. There you go. Good job. Suck it, Trebek. <laughs> oh, well played, sir. Well played. Suck it, Trebek. Incoming mission critical message. Okay, so if I deliver something in nine minutes to uh, Barrett Port. Okay, that's what we'll do. Oh, 
Um, what's, what's going on here? I can't get to my... My keybinds are working for some reason. Did you click out of the game by accident? Maybe. No. Yeah, just my, my, my key button just straight up stopped working. Well, my uh, pushing one, two, three, four to see the different parts of your. Uh, uh, yeah, it, for some reason it just stopped working. I heard Joe Bear breaking his ship again. Yeah. But where am I supposed to go? I just. got distracted, so. Here at port, right? Airport, there it is. Abra says you activated head look mode. Yeah, I'm wondering about that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, is there a, do you know what the hotkey for that is? Because uh, I don't know how I managed to do that. Crap, crap, crap. Slow down. You play with Hotus? Uh, yeah, I got a joystick. And, well, I use joystick for the majority of my stuff, and then I have a lot of keyboard keybinds. Oh, mouse three. Yeah, that's not working. That's fine. I'll check it out in between streams. Yeah, my keyboard's got um, my, my keyboard. Uh, my uh, joystick has so many buttons on it that I'm not exactly sure what they all do yet. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> all right, looking good. But surely. I should bust out the, uh, my VR headset for this. Oh no, why can't I? I can't, I can't disengage Super Cruise. Oh no. Okay. So, yeah, the, apparently I've hit a button. Okay. See, I have, a, I have a button on my joystick that engages and disengages super cruise for me. Um, it won't even register like escape. <laughs> uh oh, is is mm. like it, it's registering uh, input from my controller, mm -hmm. but it's not registering input from my keyboard. Oh, no, no, got yeah, Windows. Okay, the Windows key works. Just the game stopped registering my, um... My keyboard, that's, that's so weird. Is there a button I missed? Yeah, I, I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. Okay, well, uh... I hate to end an episode like this, but I'm basically going to have to sit here and troubleshoot and see what's going on here. Because um, I, I can't stop at this place unless I, know, I figure out what's going on with my, my keyboard. But um, 
I think what I'm going to do is uh, off camera, uh, once I get my keyboard thing figured out, um, I'm going to drop off this mission. Uh, I don't think I had anything else. Lined. I think I've maybe had one other thing lined up. I'll probably go ahead and get that taken care of tonight so I don't uh, mess anything up. But um, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. I do apologize for ending it on such a weird, weird issue. <laughs> a weird note. Uh, but anyway, you work, uh, did you enjoy the stream tonight, bud? Definitely. It's an interesting game. Yeah, it really is. And especially once you get familiar with everything and what's going on in the game, it's, it's it, it really is, can be a fun game. And then you can go out and explore, like, the alien stuff, and then there's the whole, um, oh god, what are they called? John, what are the, what are the alien dudes called? Uh, I can't remember right off. Uh, but, like, yeah, there's this whole, like, alien invasion that's happening that, that you have to go and explore and figure out stuff. And, um, yeah, we can go explore that stuff later, too, if you want. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here, guys. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button. If you like the video, make sure you like it. I appreciate it. Also, let me know what you think of, uh, Elite Dangers down in the comments. If these videos do well, I will consider doing a, uh, bringing the series back. Now I got some company. Thargoids, yeah, that's the right one. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, guys, if you're new here, uh, wait, no, 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 I already did that. Uh, so yeah, guys, be awesome, be excellent to each other, and I'll catch another video. As always, thanks for watching. Take care.